Waking up feeling like it's gon' rain It's sunny out but it just comes in waves When you ask me if I'm okay I don't have a lot to say Can't tell you something I do not know Good morning you guys it's like 8 40 in the morning on a wednesday and i thought it'd be fun to kind of do a, another day in the life vlog today pretty excited we are going to our very first concert at red rocks amphitheater which we literally bought tickets as we were moving out here so we're going to see lindsey sterling tonight we're so excited to get back to like going to concerts and stuff again and red rocks you guys we're so excited to go check it out the concert's at 7 p.m tonight um doors open at six so uh we'll be leaving here about 4 30 ish grab some food and then make our way down to red rocks but since it's wednesday it's like a normal typical work week day here so i figured it'd be kind of fun to do another day in the life so this morning i'm working on my chasm lake vlog we did over the weekend and um just got it uploaded to youtube i'll be going live sometime next week just getting all the details plugged in here and today i have my idaho springs one day travel guide going live so excited for this vlog idaho springs you guys is absolutely amazing just kind of getting youtube stuff ready for today's one going live and then um next week i have two other vlogs going live and i have to also start prepping on what we're going to do this weekend um i think we're going to go to wyoming to medicine bow that's an area we've never been to so i gotta like look into all those details and see like what there is there for hiking and sightseeing so um that's kind of my day today and then also just doing regular work Client emails and all the other stuff that I do in a day. <laughs> the other side was always green. All right, just wrapped up figuring out what we're gonna do in Medicine Bow, and we're gonna take on the Medicine Bow Peak Trail on Friday. I'm so excited. Check out these photos from others. This is on all trails. It looks so cool. Looks like an amazing hike and a really, really pretty area. So I'm really excited to go check it out. So now that I got that figured out, it's time to go work out. It's about quarter after 10. Is it any color in my dream? When you ask me if I'm okay, I don't have a lot to say. Can't tell you something. I do not know Maybe just hold me, just hold me I'm coming back slowly, so slow Leg day is done, so I'm gonna break my fast with a protein shake and basically all I'm doing is adding mixed berries, some yogurt, flaxseed, acai powder, and then I just purchased this protein powder from Unico Nutrition, and I love, love, love it. I don't know about you guys, but I'm very picky about like taste of protein powders, and this is the delicious vanilla ice cream milkshake. Mm, you guys, it's really good. And I'm gonna put a big old handful of spinach in it, so that's my post to work out today I do not know maybe just hold me just hold me I'm coming back slowly so slowly and you ask if I'm always this lonely and I forgot I actually put in some mint too we have our little herb pot here and I always take off a leaf of mint and put that in my smoothie. There we go. Now I'm just gonna add some water so it mixes well. wearing just like a casual black dress tonight for the concert it's gonna be like 85 and sunny tonight so i want something like flowy and comfortable and nothing like that's gonna make me super hot because i'm wearing a dress i'm gonna do a little bit of self tanning on my legs because they're a little white and um yeah 
the rest of my body's not this way. I don't know why my legs don't tan well, but they don't. So we're gonna self tan. <laughs> I've been using the Bondi Sands Liquid Gold Self Tanning Foam. Um, I've been using this for now, probably over a month, and I actually really, really like it. It smells good, it develops well, it doesn't look orange. So highly recommend. Here's my tanning mint. Before I tan, I actually just take some like a regular lotion and just like put it on the drier spots. So I put a little bit on my knees and then I put a little on my ankles since these are more the drier spots. It just kind of helps so that it doesn't absorb so much where it does turn like orange and gross. So highly recommend. Put a little bit of regular lotion on dry spots before you self tan. So like elbows, your uh, wrists are another one. Waking up feeling like it's gonna rain It's sunny out but it just comes in waves When you ask me if I'm okay All right, done. Develop into a beautiful tan. <laughs> it says not to wash off for at least six hours, but I'm just gonna leave it on for the entire night and when I get back home after the concert, I'll shower and wash it off. All right, I just made a quick breakfast. I just have some of these like breakfast biscuits with some butter and raspberry jelly, it's two fried eggs and two slices of a Canadian bacon underneath, an avocado, grapes, and some blueberries, and orange juice. Idaho Springs vlog is live on YouTube. And I'm just watching myself. <laughs> I don't know why I watch my videos over like two or three times just to make sure everything is correct and edited but um yeah it's always exciting launching another video on YouTube. Now I'm working on a thumbnail for another video. We went and did a sunset drive in Rocky Mountain National Park and oh my god it was so beautiful and we saw so much wildlife so we're working on creating that. It's not done yet but YouTube YouTube YouTube. All right it is time to start getting ready for the concert. I'm so excited. It's about three o'clock um so we're gonna be leaving at about 4 30 so time to get ready um so i wasn't sure what i wanted to do with my hair if i just wanted to straighten it or curl it i haven't used my three barrel for like ever ever do my makeup and all the things so my apologies for most of this video you had to see me like this this is all natural right here you guys okay, i don't have a lot to say can't tell you something i do not know so long I need to keep doing it I always just strain my ends out though I don't like like the wave at the very bottom so it kind of gives it more PC texture effect whipped out my uh, lipstick and yeah now I'm ready for a concert here is my simple little black dress <laughs> cute I just remembered I didn't put earrings in so let's go see what I got <laughs> 
choices. You guys, this are like my favorite ones. I don't know, I just love these gold. Hmm, I think I'm gonna go with these. <laughs> I wear these a lot, but you know, when you have a favorite, you just kind of stick with what you love. All right, now the assemble is complete. I got my earrings in. <laughs> so it's like four o'clock now, so we get to leave in like 30 minutes. <sighs> All right, we're starting our descent to uh, Red Rock Amphitheater. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna go grab a bite to eat quick before we go. Um, we didn't want to like cook and then do dishes and do all the things, so um, we figured let's just go grab a bite quick. Doba, it is quick and easy. All right, I just got the chicken burrito bowl, and then Vince got three tacos. Let's eat. Mmm. Hello, Doba. We are on our way to Red Rock Amphitheater. We'll be there in about a little over an hour. It is from our house. Oh my god, it's so pretty here. Super easy. A little bit of traffic, of course, but uh, easy to get here. This is so cool, you guys. We were just talking on the way here when our last concert was. It was Forever. 2019. Forever. The last time we've been to a concert when we were in Nashville. And then I think it was 2018 when we were in Minnesota, so it's been a long time. I've missed concerts. <laughs> you guys can see it, the skyline of Denver right there. Now, you guys. On June 21st, they made it full capacity here, so it's gonna be a full house. Best concert venue. This is awesome. We are pre gaming on. I got a vodka lemonade. I've never had that before. The Coors Banquet. <laughs> so $11, $10 for beer. So. Oh, At least they're really big. That house. And I got a souvenir. It's a reusable cup. <laughs> got our seats. We're in row 46, seat 79 and 80. So this is our view. Honestly, you guys, any seat here has an amazing view. It doesn't even matter. How does it feel to be in a big crowd again? It feels good. It feels so good. No mask. And yeah. Haven't seen one. <laughs> Haven't seen one. Nobody. Workers, nobody. It's kind of, it feels really good. <laughs> The Denver skyline. Check it out. Wow. Definitely not our last. That was absolutely amazing. You got Best the, concert ever. Yeah, you got the Denver skyline right behind the stage. It was like glittering all night long and people were just rocking and enjoying themselves. <laughs> it's been way too long where we haven't been able to enjoy that and it feels so good. On our way back home. Oh my god. Yeah. That was, she's such a performer. I, I don't understand how she can jump around and do all those moves with the violin in her hand. She's amazing, she truly is. Um, so this is amazing. I cannot wait for more concerts there. It's just awesome. So thank you guys so much for watching this Day in the Life vlog. Another fun event that was a first for us. We've always <laughs> wanted to go to Red Rock and- I always wanted to see her. Yeah, we always wanted to see Lindsay, so it was perfect. With that said, thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the next vlog. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for future vlogs. Bye guys. <laughs>